Hey everybody, I hope you're doing well. It has been so long since I have been at my pouring table to do a video. It's literally been, oh goodness, maybe two months, at least six weeks or so. Um, I had to prepare for a conference that I taught at at the end of October and we moved and I literally just got my studio space over my garage completed yesterday. So I have been filming some artwork on my table. It's been mostly traditional acrylic art, uh, you know, commissioned work for people and I haven't done that many pours. I've had one class in a week or so and so it's just been i uh, taken some getting used to in the new house and my new space and out of the studio I'm back home again which I'm really happy about that because then I can paint whenever I want to I don't have to do it during certain times of the day so I have missed being on video for you and it is you know it's December and it's the final month of the year it's almost Christmas and I've got a ton of inventory of uh, my paintings that I've done this past year or two. And I thought, well, I'm going to go ahead and do an, another auction. I have not done one since August, I think. It's been a little while. So this is a preview video, and the auction will be Wednesday, December 4th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And if you've never attended one of my auctions you just jump in and you have to be signed into your YouTube account if you're not signed in you cannot comment but that's the way you bid on the um, auction is you comment to the right or to the, if you're on your mobile device at the bottom of the video screen and there'll be a timer I'll announce the painting what number it is the starting bid price set the timer for two minutes and people will type in just a number like you know, if it's twenty five dollars they'll just type in twenty five and then the next person does twenty six and twenty seven and whatever and when the timer goes off at two minutes whoever has the highest bid wins the painting and there will also be a shipping charge added I will invoice you for the shipping which will be Typically, it's an additional $10 to $15 at the most, unless you uh, get multiple paintings. It might be a little bit more, but they'll still all be shipped in one box. And I package and ship things as inexpensively as possible, but it's, it's shipped with uh, insurance, and it's usually a two to three day shipping time frame. I try to keep it inside the United States because shipping outside of the U.S. is very, very pricey. If you're willing to pay the extra fees, it can be sometimes $60 to ship a painting to somewhere outside of the United States. So that's just up to you if you want to pay for that extra shipping. I'm going to try to offer this auction. I'm offering a lot more of my art in with the acrylic pours. It's not just acrylic pours this time because I thought it would just be kind of fun to throw in some of my acrylic pours plus my artistic flair because I've been an artist for 20 years. So that is um, what's going to happen. So there are 35 pieces basically and uh, I'm also at the very end of the auction I'm going to pick out a number out of a bowl or container or something and whatever that number is between 1 and 35 whoever gets the winning bid on that painting say it's number 10 and number 10 is called Enchanted Forest whoever wins that painting at the end when I draw out that number and whatever that number is and if I drew a 10 that person is going to win a free print on canvas. This is my bonus for this auction that I've never done this before but I had this 
print done on canvas. So it's a 16 by 20. So it's not an original, but it is a printed canvas of the autumn tree, which was one of my tutorials. And I am going to give this away for free to one lucky person. And that will be a random number that I draw at the end of the auction. So if you're a winner of one of the auction pieces on Wednesday night, you'll have a chance to win this print. One person will. So that's going to be the bonus that I throw in that I've never done before. So I'm excited about that. Also, I have um, printed up my angel painting and it's on a print, a photo print, and it's mounted on a card. So you can write on the card. It comes with its own envelope. So you get envelopes with it. I have two different ones that I have done. I've got my autumn trees and my angel painting. And so I've got lots of them, lots and lots. So the, the price is $3 for one card, three cards for $7, or 10 cards for $15. So again, one card is $3, three cards is $7, and 10 cards is $15. So if you're interested in cards, email me, sandralettart at yahoo.com and let me know. And also, the other thing I wanted to mention, I have a video that's already on YouTube uh, that talks about my calendar for 2020. This is it right here. This is my preview calendar. I'm getting ready to order a bulk order. And so I am placing that bulk order this week and I will be shipping out the calendars before Christmas. And so this is the calendar. Uh, so it's, it's an art calendar of my 12, 13 actually, favorite pieces for this past year. And what you can do is you can use it as a calendar, but you can also at the end of the year cut out the art and have it matted and framed if you would like. It's a great way to have several pieces of my art, you know, in calendar form and then you can also frame it later. So there's the cherry blossom. That was my wisteria on a, a green pour. This one is actually in the auction here. This is the swipe flower garden where I embellished a pour. April is my hydrangeas, which I, that was all fluid art. May, this was one of my tutorials called Floral Passion, which I sold that piece. This was a painting I did for someone, a commissioned painting, and that's the month of June, which is a pour with shells painted on it. July was my beta fish that I painted on a pour, and then I made this into a digital art piece. So that is July, has that very red, white, and blue feel to it. This is the August piece. September was my uh, Zentangle kind of embellishment on top of a strainer pour, which had kind of a feathered look, and so that was pretty popular because that was a copper piece. It was really pretty. It sold. I sold this one. This was a tutorial I did and it's a black cat with pumpkins for October. November is a tree commission that I did for someone. It just looks like fall trees. So that's November. And December is one of the pieces that's in this auction. It's a red poppies on top of a green uh, dirty pour. So that is my calendar. It's $21 and I will provide a link in the video up at the top if you want to go over to my website if you click on that and purchase it for $21 that includes my shipping to you and everything you can get your calendar 
and if you live outside of the United States it's very expensive to ship so I do not recommend if you're outside of the US it's going to be at least $20 to ship the calendar unless you want to pay $20 for shipping so this is the uh, 2020 calendar that I did this year I did one last year and it was really popular and I had lots of people asking about it so that's for the calendar so I'm going to go ahead and get started on the preview here and we're going to go through these kind of quickly so the first piece is called Bella it's number one this is a an eight inch cradle board and uh, this was more of an abstract looking fluid floral piece that I did. So that's Bella, and that's number one, an eight by eight. Starting bid on that is $30. This is an eight by eight canvas. This is Mysterious Flower, number two. The starting bid is $30. So this is an abstract looking floral Number three is an 8x10 canvas break of dawn. So this is a swipe that has a little bit of metallic gold and it just it kind of has that warm glow feeling. So I called it break of dawn and I embellished it with some white line work. This is an 8x10 break of dawn. The starting bit is $25. Number four is angelic. This is a 10 by 10 inch canvas. It does have a little bit of metallic gold in there. And most of these have a gloss finish on them. This is number four, Angelic. $25 is a starting bid. Number five is Transformation. This is a 12 by 12 inch canvas. Transformation, number five. This was a tree ring pour and there's no video on this one. I did this in a class but it turned out really neat and um, I don't think that there was any OGX or whatever. It just made its own cells but this is a 12 by 12. Starting bid is $25. Number six is called Feathers. It's a 12 by 12. It, this is orange and red. This is copper. Then there's a mulberry and a gold with the glitter in it. It has sparkles of glitter. I don't know if you can see the glitter or not. And then black and kind of fiery colors and a little bit of copper along the top edge again. So again this is number six, feathers. Starting bid is $25. Number seven is Flow in Love. Instead of I'm so in love, I'm flow in love. <laughs> so this is a 12 by 12, another tree ring pour, and it does have that metallic gold there in some of the layers. So again, this is a 12 by 12, Flow in Love. Starting bid is $25. Number eight. This was finger painted with fluid art. It's called From Within. Number eight. I did this whole thing with the fluid acrylics and my fingers. After it was dried, I embellished it with this butterfly in the center. So this is number eight. It's a 12 by 12. From Within. Starting bid is $35. Number nine is called Entangled. It's an 11 by 14 and this is a, an infinity pour and uh, there is metallic gold that is sprinkled in there. You can see the highlights of the metallic gold. So this one is Entangled, number nine. Starting bid is $30 on this 11 by 14. I also wanted to show you the companion piece that I did at the same time with the same colors. This one I called Enchanted Forest. This is number 10. It's a 12 by 12 and it is $25. So they have the same colors 
and they could be companions for each other. So if someone wanted to bid on this and get both, I will give you $10 off. So it would, the starting bid would be $30 and $25, which is $55, and together they would be $45 for a starting bid if someone is interested in them as a pair. So one is 11 by 14 and one is a 12 by 12. Both have a glossy finish. Number 11 is called White Bloom and I love this painting. Uh, this was done with a bunch of metallic uh, gold and kind of the jewel tones and a little bit of white that just kind of, you know, how that white sometimes just blooms into its own thing. That's why I called it a white bloom. So this is 12 by 12 and like I said that beautiful metallic gold, that very shimmery 24 karat gold. The starting bid is $25 for this white bloom painting. Number 12, this is a swipe flower garden. So this was a swipe underneath and then I embellished it after it was dried with white and it's got a gloss finish. So this is number 12, Swipe Flower Garden. And this one is $40 for the starting bid. Here's a number 13, Golden Splash. This one is very shimmery and it's got a glass-like finish. This one I put a lot of varnish on for some reason. And uh, so it almost looks like it's resined and the metallic gold is very shimmery. So it's black and gold and white. Golden Splash number 13, 12 by 12. It is $25 for the starting bid. Number 14 is Night Blooms and the same colors black, gold, and white. This was a swipe and then I added some of these bloom type shapes at the bottom. It's 11 by 14 glossy finish. So it's got that uh, 24 karat gold mixed in there. The starting bid on this one is $35. And it would make a good companion piece for the other white one. And I have one other that I did at the same time. This one's called Classic Beauty. It's number 15. 11 by 14. The same black, gold, and white combination. The nice shimmery metallic gold. So that's 11 by 14, Classic Beauty, number 15. The starting bid is $35. Number 16, 11 by 14. This is all metallics on a black background. Whirlwind Romance, number 16. So it's all metallic paints even the lavender color. Uh, maybe the purple is not, but the metallic, this a uh, silver to blue, sapphire, metallic, and metallic gold. And um, this is an 11 by 14 tree ring pour. This one is $35 starting bid. Again, 11 by 14. And of uh, this last set here, this is a set that comes together. They're 11 by 14s, both of them. It's called Soar. So the set comes together, two 11 by 14s, and the beginning bid is $45 for both of them together. They come as a set. All right, number 18 is an 8 by 10 canvas panel. It's just poppies painted on a periwinkle purple background. This is called Poppies Number no. 1. This is $50. 8 by 10 Poppies Number no. 1. Poppies Number no. 2 is Number no. 19. This was the in the calendar. It's the green uh, dirty pour and the poppies and butterfly are painted on top and it's varnished. Number 19, poppies number two. Starting bid is $50. Poppies number three. This one is a dirty pour. Eight by 10 and 
the poppies in a butterfly. Has that red, deep red with the touch of the bright orange popping through it. This is number 20, poppies number three. Starting bid is $50. Number 21 is Bohemian Rainbow Flower. It's an eight by 10. This was one I did a tutorial on, on Thinkific. If you are not certain what that is, I teach how to paint traditional acrylics. If you've never learned and you would like to learn, you can purchase any class for $35. And uh, so this is a tutorial I did, an 8x10 Bohemian Rainbow Flower, number 21, starting bid is $55. Number 22, Bush Robin. This is a, another tutorial that I did on Thinkific. It's on an 8x10 canvas panel. And it's a cute little robin. I love to paint birds. So this is, the starting bid is $55 on this. Number 23, Let Your Love Shine. This is a 9 by 12. This was a tutorial. Showed you how to do a painting and make it more whimsical and fun. Let Your Love Shine. I'm always about being positive and being an encouragement to people and through my art. So I'm always trying to think of ways to do that. This one is again a 9 by 12, Let Your Love Shine, number 23, the starting bid is $55. Number 24, this one is a 9 by 12 called Country Road, 24 Country Road, 9 by 12, and the starting bid is $60. This was a tutorial as well that I t uh, teach how to paint a landscape. And those tutorials are for beginners. So you don't have to have any experience to do these paintings. I sh teach you every step of the way. This is one I just did recently, number 25, Cactus Fiesta. 9 by 12. This was just fun and funky and colorful. So Cactus Fiesta, 9 by 12, $55. Starting bid. So here is the original Autumn Tree, number 26. This is the inspiration for the print that I'm giving away for free at the end of the auction on Wednesday night. So this was a tutorial that I did on Thinkific. This is a 9 by 12, number 26, Autumn Tree. It's full of bright colors. Starting bid is $55. This is also a tutorial that I did. It's an abstract. This one is 11 by 14. It's called Surrender and you can hang it any way that you want to. That's the cool part about abstract art. Number 27, Surrender, an 11 by 14. Starting bid is 60. Number 28, Wave of Consciousness. So this was an 11 by 14 acrylic pour that I did uh, in a class, teaching a class, and it's varnished. Wave of Consciousness 28. Again, it's acrylic pour 11 by 14. Starting bid is $40. Did this in a class recently, and this is a 14 by 14 inch canvas. Number 29, it's called Fairyland and it's a swipe that's kind of abstract feeling. It's got little blooms in it and uh, there's metallic gold that's also in there sprinkled in. There's metallic. Got these little flowers that are funky at the bottom. This is a 14 by 14 inch canvas and a gloss finish. Number 29, Fairyland. Starting bid is $45. This is number 30, Colorful Horizons. It's an abstract and it is a 12 by 16 canvas. I taught this in a class with someone. You can orient it any way you want to. I kind of like it this way. It kind of feels like a landscape in a way, in a very abstract way. And uh, 
so I called it Colorful Horizons. Again, it is a 16 by 12. $65 is the starting bid. Number 31, Gracious Growth. This down so you can see the whole thing. This one is a 10 by 20. It was a string pull and my swiped leaves. Kind of a modern take on it. And it is again a 10 by 20. Starting bid is $45. Gracious growth. Put this one down on the table as well. This one is number 32. Tree at gloaming. This one is, it was an acrylic pour in the background and then I embellished it with the tree and the gold leaves so it's very metallic gold feeling and copper. The blue accents are kind of a turquoise pearl color and there's copper and a little bit of a dirty pour that comes through in the background. This one is a 14 by 18 gallery wrapped, so it is a deep canvas. And uh, just so you can see all the metallic colors. Copper and the pearly turquoise, that's really beautiful. So this one is $70 is the starting bid. Number 32, Tree at Gloaming. This was a larger one, 16 by 20 metallics. It would be actually a really pretty complement to the, the last one I just showed. This is called Precious Metals. It is gold and copper and black and that beautiful pearlescent aqua color. Called Precious Metals, 16 by 20. And the starting bid on this is $60. This was another one of my favorites and I wanted to bring it back and um, it's called Tropical Punch. I want you to get in there and see that metallic gold mixed in. These are balloon smashes and swiped leaves and just beautiful colors of the petals that all blend together with the metallic gold accents. You can see the metallics. So this one is 16 by 20 Tropical Punch. That's number 34. The starting bid is $50. I do have some of these wired as well. Um, this one is number 35 and I'm going to turn it this way. This one is a 12 by 24 inch. It's called Purple Tropical Flowers. This was balloon smash and then I kind of embellished it while it was all wet and did the leaves with my palette knife, that kind of thing. So it's full of uh, purple and turquoise and golden yellow and black and white and greens. Purple Tropical Flowers, 12 by 24. This one, the starting bid is $65. And then I had one left that I had in the mix and somehow my numbers got messed up. So I'm putting it in at the end here. So we've got one last one. It's number 36 and it is called Sea Turtle. And this was a tutorial that I did on Thinkific and teaching you how to paint a sea turtle. And so, the starting bid on this one is $55. This is an 8x10 sea turtle. So I would love to have you come over and join me Wednesday evening at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So that's you know, where I'm, I'm not New York time. I'm in North Carolina. And uh, you have to be logged into your YouTube account in order to comment and bid. Because if you're not logged in, YouTube sees you as spam because you're not logged in as a person. So they count you as spam and you can't comment. So you have to be logged in and um, 
we'll do the timer, a two minute timer. You'll just name your bid price and when the timer goes off you win that bid. I will email you an invoice with the winning bid price plus shipping. And shipping can range anywhere from usually $9 to $15 or $20 depending on if you get a larger piece. The other added bonus is Wednesday night at the end of the auction I'm going to draw a number between 1 and 36 because I have 36 pieces. When I draw that number out of the bucket or whatever it is that I draw it out of, that number on the list of items I just sold, that person will get the free 16 by 20 autumn tree printed canvas. This one is printed. I sold, I mean, I don't, I didn't sell the original. It's in the auction here as an, you know, the size that I painted it. But I'm giving away a really big 16 by 20 for free to one lucky auction bid winner. Uh, that, that wins a bid on one of the other items, they're going to get this put into their package. I'll cover the extra shipping and it's going to come with your piece that you win in your bid. And the more pieces you bid on, it'll all still come in one box, so the shipping will still be economical because it will be packaged together. And again, if you are interested, I'm placing my final order this week for the 2020 calendar. And make sure to get your copy. If you're interested, click on the link, go to my website. And right on the website, if you scroll down, it'll say pre-order your, your calendar. You just put in your information and your shipping address and your credit card. It's $21. That covers shipping and everything, and I will send you your calendar before Christmas. And uh, if you're interested, email me, sandraletart at yahoo.com. If you're interested in the cards that I mentioned at the beginning, the angel card. This is a great as to give as a gift as well. Um, you can give it to someone, and they can take this and detach the print and have it matted and framed. And I also did the autumn tree one same way. So it's mounted on a card and it comes with its own envelopes. And again, those are $3 for one card, $7 for three cards, or $15 for 10 cards. So you get a better savings the more you get. So I think that wraps it up. I'm so happy to be working again out of my art studio and um, I'll post a video a little bit later on with uh, the transformation of what it looked like before I got it all together and the way it looks now. It's a mess but it's my studio. So I've missed everybody. I hope you're doing well. I hope the holiday season coming up will be great for all of you and it finds you happy and healthy. And, um, you know, we all have issues and ups and downs in our life, and I'm one of those people as well, as you all know. And I just try to make the most of what I have in life, and uh, art is my therapy. I enjoy sharing it with you. You know, I appreciate you being in my life and following my journey. And I really look forward to sharing this auction with you and hopefully getting to ship you some beautiful art that you possibly will have for your Christmas present or maybe to give it to someone as a Christmas present. You never know. So thank you so much for watching. I love you all. Hugs to everybody. I'll stick my face in and say, hey, I don't look great. I've been working today. But anyway, I hope you all have a great evening and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.